Welcome back to Unbiased and Unbossed. A couple of days ago, I posted a video about a young lady and her domestic abuse story that had gone viral. It was picked up on one of the social media blogs. And within that video, she alluded to a young lady who was her friend had then turned around and started messing with her boyfriend, who was actually also her abuser. However, since that video has started circulating, the family has come out to say that not all is as it seems. So I'm going to post what the family has posted to their own Instagram page and then go from there at the end. The music stops, so I'll just speak for the rest of the video. At this point, they're dating. He's holding me hostage in his apartment with her help. She wanted a polygamous relationship with six women. But they all were gonna be, they had to be young and be, he wanted them to be submissive. Yes, and young. That's the key word. Yeah. Young. He would go out. He would give me his phone to go get a girl's number if he thought she was attractive. At this point, they're dating. He's holding me hostage in his apartment with her help. Because Luana was my best friend. She helped me do my best friend. She helped me do a lot, bro. She did it. I want justice for Walana Bibbs to be trending. So let's make that happen, guys. Let's repost everything that I've posted about her and make justice for Walana Bibbs trend. Because it's everywhere, right? It's on Complex, it's on Baller Alert, it's on Shade Room, it's on... But where are all these celebrities? Why is nobody else talking about this? This is what I don't like about the industry or social media. So sorry I ever introduced your daughter to this monster. Fun record. No, it's never gonna come out. Well, tonight. whatever you do. I'll push the button yeah. and apply pressure. But I ain't talking about that. Either. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Woo. That's all I'm gonna say. When I, when I push buttons. Wait, what was that last part? Like it because it's a little inappropriate. But I just need you with to your permission. Real. That's not my real mom, by the way. I just call her mom because there's a couple women in my life that I call mom, including Nas' mom. So I want justice for Walana Bibbs to be trending. He was not pissing us out. He wanted a polygamous relationship with six women. But they all were getting... They had to be young and be... He wanted them to be submissive. Yes. And young. That's... So I want justice for Walana Bibbs to be trending. So let's make that happen, guys. Let's repost everything that I posted about her and make justice for Walana Bibbs trend. Cause it's everywhere, right? It's Look 
at Walana. Look at that beautiful baby girl. I love you, Walana. The official Anne was dishonest in her initial video. You know, she's still a, a, a victim of Jay Wright's, and she could have just left it at that without including Willanna Bibbs. And her story would have still been her story. However, by her including Willanna as a villain, because that's what she made her seem, knowing that this young lady was someone she pursued in the interest of Jay Wright having another girlfriend in the same household as them, it was very disrespectful and it was very diabolical because this family is grieving. And ultimately, you're the reason why this young lady was even around him to begin with. So knowing that, I do feel as though that I needed to, to post this video to show that, you know, abused individuals can also be predators lastly it's never my intent to hurt harm or disrespect the friends or family members of the stories of the individuals that I highlight so if that has ever happened or happened in this case you have my apology I wanted to bring light to Willena Bibbs as well as the official Anne. And now that I know the other side, I do agree that anybody who shared her story should post the other side, which is Willanna Bibbs' side, which her family is sharing. I hope that Jay Wright gets life in prison with no ability to be paroled, and may Willanna Bibbs rest in peace. <laughs>